In today's automotive industry, even the smaller car makers are facing the need to shift towards electric vehicles. This transition is particularly challenging for companies specializing in sports cars, where balancing the addition of batteries and electric motors against the traditional lightweight design is crucial. One example of overcoming this challenge is Caterham's Electric Coupe, which demonstrates the possibility of minimizing the added weight. Now another well-known British brand is stepping into the spotlight with its own version of a sporty electric vehicle. Introducing the Morgan XP1, an innovative prototype that boasts an electric-only setup. Its design is a modification of the Ford-powered Super 3, but with a significant change, the removal of its traditional engine components to accommodate the new electric system. A notable aspect of this vehicle is that it features Morgan's first self-developed powertrain, a milestone for the company, whether in terms of a combustion engine or an electric motor. To manage production costs, the electric motor was cleverly integrated into the existing transmission tunnel. This motor delivers 134 horsepower and sends its power to the rear wheel. The power source is a compact 33 kilowatt hour battery neatly fitted under the hood, a space usually reserved for the gasoline engine in the Super 3. When fully charged, this battery provides around 150 miles of driving range. The Morgan XP1 stands out for its lightweight, tipping the scales at under 1,543 pounds, only marginally heavier by about 132 pounds than its gasoline variant. Notably, the car's aerodynamics have been improved. By modifying the underbody, wheels, and front design, the drag coefficient was reduced from 0.65 to 0.42, enhancing efficiency by a third. Additionally, the Morgan XP1 comes with four drive modes, each whimsically represented by chili symbols on the digital display. To accommodate the added weight, the vehicle is equipped with adjustable nitron dampers and modified spring rates. The battery is not only capable of fast charging, but also supports bi-directional charging. As for production plans, Morgan's chief technical officer, Matt Hole, hinted to Autocar that a commercial version of the XP1 would be priced slightly higher than the Super 3, which currently sells for $53,938 in the United States. Morgan operates 12 showrooms across the country. However, the company has yet to confirm any specific details regarding the production model.